welcome back you guys for some reason this is like very sensitive um so welcome back to another video and this is going to be on slime rancher 2 as you can already see now i haven't checked out any of this and i am really really tired and i mean really tired it's coming up on 12 a.m i have been up since around 6 a.m. I have been working my ass off. I have been sitting there battling it out like crazy on video games all day. And now I'm making a video. <laughs> Pretty stupid, ain't it? But you know, I'm actually going to try to pull through this and get a video done on Slime Rancher 2. I have yet to play any of this. I have not started any of it. I was actually planning on playing some of it on my other account to like get the feel of it and see what's going on. But you know what? I decided to say, let's get the first reaction on 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 film. You know, you just get it up and running. Let's get our first reaction going. This will not be. Well, eh, I don't know. It depends on how it goes. It it depends on how this goes on if it's actually going to be the first episode of Slime Rancher 2 or not. But it most likely won't be the first episode of Slime Rancher 2. We'll probably save that for another time. And this just be our like little bit of a reaction playthrough. Stuff like that. I don't know. We'll see. You'll definitely be able to see by the name of the video. But, you know, we'll see. Now, I did, however, see one good change, because I went through the options here while I was getting the video all set up. You can change your field of view now. Which is uh, <laughs> amazing. Overscan adjustment? I have no idea what this is. Scales the overall size of the user interface in cases where the monitor crops the edges of the screen. I'm not too worried about that. I really don't care. But you can change your FOV now, which is amazing, because that's like the biggest issue that I had on Slime Rancher 1. Like, I could not increase the FOV, and it was really annoying me because of how close to everything I was. So, hopefully it's a little bit better now. But let's actually begin this. What save icon do we want? We don't have a tabby slime, do we? Oh, we do have a tabby slime, a pog. Gotta go with the t t tabby slime. Uh, we'll keep the tutorial pop-ups. Why not? Tar. Of course, we're gonna have that. They will damage the player, spoil food, and devour other slimes. Interesting. Well, we're gonna keep that on anyway. Feral, feral slimes appear in small in a small number of locations in the world. A bit grumpy will often damage player. This okay, well whatever. We're keeping that. The player damage. No way. You could adjust that. Modifies the damage received by the player from all so sources. Reducing this can reduce difficulty while increasing it can increase difficulty. How far we can we increase it? So we can only increase it by 0.5. Maybe we can do that, you know? That's a little bit of a series, you know? And do a hardcore playthrough. I don't know. But so far, that seems good. We're going to do 1x diff uh, player damage because, you know... I do Well, should we do more than that? I don't know. I think we should get the feel of it and see if it is just like Slime Rancher 1 and if we should increase the difficulty a bit. Because I know Slime Rancher 1 was a little bit off. You didn't really have much to do in it. There wasn't much of a danger. I am not going to read this. If you guys want to read it, go on ahead and pause the video. I'm not going to read it.
Oh my god, the FOV is amazing. I am so zoomed out though. Oh my god. Oh my god, it looks so weird when I'm running with it. <laughs> I've achieved pink slime. The backpack can suck things up. Yep, 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 yep. Are there a lot more pins than there used to be? There is a lot more pins than there used to be. In the tutorial area. That's nice. Should we just go around and try collecting all these pink slimes then? It's probably a good idea, you know. What do we have here? Okay, so we have a few familiar slimes here. We got pink, we got the phosphor slimes, we got rock slimes, crystal slimes, magma slimes, fire slimes, the raccoon slimes, which is also named hunter slimes. Uh, that looks to be a tabby slime, but unsure. It looks a little bit different than a tabby slime. Pond slime from the looks of it. Oh no. We have a few new ones here. Oh, I'm not worried about that. You vac the slime. Yes, I did vac the slime. Dude, can I like stay like just say that there is one fucking big thing that I love about this and that is the graphics. What the fuck is that? Oh, it's a chicken. I'm so zoomed out, I didn't see what it <laughs> what it was at first. Maybe we should uh turn this down just a little bit. That seems a little bit better. Yeah, I can see way better now. And it's not too so zoomed in either. Uh, there we go. Um, so we got high walls. Music box. Air net. Solar shield. Plort collector. Auto feeder. Okay, so the these things are basically the exact same then. That's That's a little bit boring. Okay, so what the fuck is this? What is this? System offline. Pointing up to like the sun at Oh no. Okay, so we have a new area. This dark, damp, mushroom-covered expansion to the conservatory is a refuge from the sun for slimes and ranchers alike. Interesting. So that might be like the cave area. What is what is down here? Pogo fruit. We got pipes down here? What the hell? A little water spout. An upgrade is needed to harvest this. Is that a giant tree out there? Okay, well, it looks like we found the boat that we came in on. More pink slimes. We're gonna want to vac those up, cause you know, more items that we have, the better. Oh, we got some carrots here. We're definitely gonna want some of that, so we got fruits and veggies. Oh, take a look at that, bunny. It's a cotton slime.
Okay, so it doesn't give me the name of what... Okay, there we go. Water lettuce. Um, okay. Water lettuce. Where the fuck would I find water lettuce at? I want more of these. Alright, I think I collected enough bunny slimes. Should we try to find our way back before we start exploring everywhere? <laughs> I do, after all, need to play the actual game in order to, to truly progress. Okay, and now we're back. Are we able to buy another thing? We are. A coop, a silo, incinerator, and a pond. Well, I think we need this first. As known by the rabbits, we need that. Is this pen bigger than the other ones? I don't remember being able to fit in that many slimes in one pen and have this much space still left. Huh. Alright, so now we have some pink plorts. From the pink slimes. They're selling for eight right now. Okay. That's not bad. What upgrades do we have for this? Nutrient soil, sprinkler, scare slime. Okay, so just the same things from before as well. Bonk. Just so we can get so... What the hell is that? Get up in there. You'll be eaten too when you grow up. Can I make it from all the way over here? Bed it up. Ah, oh, I didn't make it. Alright, now we kind of need another pen now for the rabbit slimes, but the only issue is that we can't do that. I wonder if I'm able to combine them with the pink slimes. I'm pretty sure I am. But do I want to? I don't know. I say let's try to come over here and try to explore it a little bit more. What's off this edge, by the way? What is this? Oh, it's a research drone. Okay. Well, there's a path down there. I don't really see much that is happening down here, though. What is that? There's a cave up there. Oh my goodness gracious, treasure pods are in the game. And I can open it without an upgrade! Hydro turret. So I've I've acquired a hydro turret. Usually that's the type of shit that you get way. L what the fuck? Okay. Usually that's the type of shit that you get way late in the game, but you know I I guess not this time. This is super interesting. 
Oh, okay, so you can't combine with them with the pink ones. Bang. Wow, they really fly up high there. Wow. I gotta admit, they're, they're, the slimes animations are a little bit better on this one, too. Like, they actually look like actual slimes. Oh, what is that? Oh, it's a phosphor slime. I'm not gonna worry about it right now. I'm not too worried about phosphor slimes at this moment. I'm kind of hoping to find a new slime. Hello. I found a Largo. Also kind of hoping to find the little rabbit slime's favorite food. We have a map piece. Oh my god, do we have a map? We do have a map. Wow, we have a lot of places. Honestly, I'd say not a lot of places. Because it's just this area over here, this spot, and then this spot. Then again, they also did say that they were going to expand on what is seen here. So, we're definitely going to be seeing a larger world than this. But as of currently, it looks like this is it. That is way larger than it used to be. Look how many plots are there. Hell yeah. That's pretty cool. Alright, well let's grab this map thing. Hello. Oh, what the fuck? I only got that piece? So how do I get over there? This is how I get over there. Up to you guys to pause the video and read that. What the hell is this? Refinery links? Refinery links conveniently transports his resources and ports to the refinery where they can be used exclusively for slime science and slime and science lab. Uh, I will have to admit, this is awesome. I love how this is right there. There's the next map piece. And hello, it is a tabby slime. Let's go in and pick that up so we know what we need for it later on. What it is in this though, because I know we have the map piece over there, but what about over here? Nothing. Okay, so there's nothing over here. And I don't know why I walked all the way right there. There's no way up there. Look at that. It's blurry. You can barely see it. But there's a ring above that island back there that is floating. I can't wait to find out what that is. Oh, look. It's the tar. Not like we didn't know that was coming already. So we know where to find tabby slimes at now. Wow, it marks the refinery link on my fucking map? No way. That really does help out a little bit. <gasps> Cube bears. What the fuck is that? What is that? It's like a pink blob. That's a lot of tabby slimes. Just like to point that out. Upgrade is needed to harvest this. No way. Is that what I think it is? I think that's one of the things that you usually only get from mining stuff. Now, I heard a crystal thing. Uh, Trash pot. Emerald Cypress. I don't know what an Emerald Cypress is, but whatever. I tried to look at it, but you know, it didn't give me anything. So what is this? I'm so interested in all these different things. What is that up there? What is that up there? I need to find a way up there.
Dang, I thought this was the way up there, but you know, I guess not. Hey, Pink Largo! Oh, hold on. Strats? Big time strats? Damn it. That's a lot of Largos. Now how would I manage to get all the way over there though? I think I would need the jet. Yeah, I think I would need a jet pack. What the fuck? Oh, I thought that that was weird. Thought I was seeing something else that wasn't actually that. Okay, well, it seems like I've kind of that's that's an abomination. <laughs> <laughs> That is a major abomination right there. Okay, so we have a lot of cotton ports right here. Let's go ahead and just grab some of these. Um, there's another cotton port. Oh wow, there's like tons of cotton ports. I'm going to try to collect some more rabbits. Wait, what the fuck is that? What is that? Is that what I think it is? It is what I think it is. Yes! I got water lettuce, boys. That is what is up. Now, how the fuck do I get back to base? This way. I actually managed... Hello. There's another Largo. I actually managed to gather... Water lettuce. I'm happy about myself. Okay, so now what we're going to need to do is we're going to need to... Wow, they cost 50 to remove a crop now. Ooh. Ooh. Why are... Oh my god, it's because they're getting out because they're jumping over the wall. That's pretty annoying, actually. Whatever. I think it's because they're all trying to go for the food. Because they're hungry. Let's just try to leave only this amount in here for now, considering that they're trying to go for that food and they can't necessarily get it. Twenty-nine. Wow. That's awesome. Okay, so now we're going to put the rabbit slimes right here. Alright, now they're all in one place. Can I get the high walls for these guys? Okay, cool. So I could... But I instead want the high walls for the pink slimes over here. So I can then put all the pink slimes back in place. Now what would it cost to get the plort collector? 500. That sucks. 
All right, now I can get high walls for those rabbits, but there's no point in getting high walls for them just yet. All right. Did, what the fuck is that? It marked a Largo for me? I mean, technically I discovered two Largos, so I wonder... Why it hasn't marked the other Largos. There's a purple area back there. I think that's a cave that I couldn't get into because it was too high. So as far as I know currently, we have already discovered every possible thing in this area currently except for all of this. So what I can do is I can go sleep real quick. What? Sleep until morning, sleep until night, sleep for six hours, return to the conservatory. Does this mean that there are going to be different bases? Meaning like the islands, like the islands that we see that is covered in fog right here and right here. Does that mean we're going to have separate conservatories for these two islands as well? That's super interesting. But it's amazing how we can sleep for six hours. Instead of actually sleeping for a whole 24 hours. That actually helps out a lot, honestly. Okay, so we're going to sleep till morning. Which didn't really last long. <laughs> um... Why are there carrots out here? Bang, bang. So we're just going to take the opportunity and sleep for six hours here. And maybe another six hours. Because, you know, I'm stupid. What is this? It has an exclamation point on it now. Victor Humphreys. Take this home portal. It should make the early stages of your journey easier. Yellow home portal. A yellow home portal. How would I use that yellow home portal? Hello. Okay, so how do I use the yellow home portal then? Hello. I don't know how I would use the yellow home portal. Like, that's kind of like a little bit of a worry, honestly. Like, I want to know how I'd use the yellow home portal, but I. Okay, so I just had to buy high walls for this one real quick. It kind of sucks that I had to buy high walls for that one, but you know, things happen. I had to. But good thing, I'm going to get it all back right here. Now we can get a plort collector, which we want on this one. There we go. Now we have acquired a plort collector. And now we can get an auto feeder next. And then also in the next episode, which we'll be doing 
in a little bit. Literally, like, I'm going to record it right after this one. But, um, for now, this is actually going to be the end of the first episode, because we will do the whole episode thing. Sadly enough, I think we can do it. Why is there a chicken here? Um, so we'll do all that. Because, honestly, I was really expecting a little bit more and a little bit more to explore right off the bat. But apparently, there is not much to explore. So, I'm going to go off and actually figure a way out to get everything done. And then I will actually be back with everybody in the next episode. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. And peace out.